groove. watching my channel and today I'm going to be showing you guys everything I'm bringing for the cruise I'm going on in a few days so yeah I packed everything up this morning and now I'm going to show you guys everything I'm bringing I've been on a cruise once before and it was in October of 2018 and when you're on the cruise you don't like realize how fun it is but then when you look back at it you're like dang that's like so fun like you just get it like be trapped on a boat, basically. And it's so fun, I love cruises. So, we're going on another one for my sister and my dad's birthday. And it's a pretty funny story, because we weren't gonna go on a cruise, like we were not planning on going on a cruise at all this year. It literally came out of nowhere. Because one day, I woke up to a text message from my best friend Ava, and her family was gonna go on the cruise, and she goes, hey, my brother isn't going on a cruise anymore. Would you want to come with me? And I was like, Ava, are you crazy? My parents would never let me go on a cruise with, like, a random family. And I was like, Girl, are you crazy? That's never happening. And then her mom texted my dad because they had called before so I could go somewhere with them. And my dad told my mom. And my mom was like, Sure, let me see how it is. Like, let me get the information and stuff. And then we talked to this guy and we booked the ticket thingies I guess they're called I don't know what they're called but we're going on the cruise and I'm going with my best friend Ava and my family so so fun okay <laughs> so yeah I'm really excited it's only a three-day cruise basically yeah it's basically a three-day cruise it is Friday we get on the boat and then we have Saturday Sunday and then we get off on the boat on Monday and on Monday I have softball tryouts at six so it's gonna be a pretty busy week, I guess. So, before I do this, I goes too. And also, some amazing on screen, I'll link to right down below. So, now I'm gonna show you guys everything I am bringing. And I wanted to bring pretty cute outfits because the last cruise I went on, I barely took any pictures. I don't have any pictures posted on my Instagram from when I went on that cruise. And it's kind of crazy because, like, who goes on a cruise and doesn't take pictures? I didn't take pictures for some reason. So I want to take pictures this time. So I brought some pretty cute outfits and I'm going to show you guys some. I haven't built the outfits. I just have a bunch of clothes because <laughs> I don't feel like building outfits because whenever I build outfits, I just don't end up even wearing the outfits. So I decided to just pack a bunch of clothes. It's only a three day cruise. Remember that. Okay. And this is just the clothes right here. I'm bringing a lot of stuff because I'm so indecisive about what I wear. And it's probably going to take us a long time to get ready. And basically, um, Ava's parents, they booked a room just for her because her and her brother are going to stay in that room. But her brother isn't going anymore because he has districts for basketball. So, me, Kaylee, Ava, and Emily maybe are staying in that room that Ava par Ava's parents got her. So, we're all going to stay in there. So, we're most likely going to be sharing each other's clothes among the trip because it's just like whenever you go on a trip you just don't like anything that you brought and you're like I don't want to wear this anymore so we're gonna share probably most likely let's start off with the shirts so I have a bunch not a bunch but I have like a bit of cute tops because I live in Florida and I have a lot of tank tops and stuff like that so um I actually took some from my cousin this is one of the ones I took from my cousin it is just this American Eagle cropped like tank and it looks really tiny but it's not really that tiny. It is just white and black striped and it's really cute. I love it. It's so adorable. So I took this one for my cousin because she doesn't wear it and I was like, girl, I like this. So I took it. And this is also from American Eagle. This one's actually mine. It is this um, flowy. This one's a little, a little bit longer and flowier and it's just white and then it has brown buttons down the middle but it just looks like this it's probably going to be over a bathing suit because it's really flowy it's like th like three nights and so there's three like dinners but on the second night is the fancy dinner so i'll show you guys that my outfit for that in a minute so another tank top that i'm bringing this one's actually from target and it's just this yellow button shirt and it's really cute this will also probably go over a tank top or when we're walking around at night i'll probably wear something like this because it's not really fancy it's just kind of like an 
simple shirt. And then this is a bodysuit and I wore this on New Year's Eve and it's just this. It looks like it's a bodysuit. It's from H&M and it is blue, white, and red and it's kind of like a v-neck and it has spaghetti straps and just a bodysuit and it's really cute. And I'll probably wear this with shorts most likely. And this one is one of my cousins that I took from her. This one is from Hollister and it's kind of like this knitted one and it also looks really tiny but like I swear it's not that tiny. It stretches. But it has thicker straps and it just looks like this and this will look really cute with some shorts. And I'm bringing a lot of tops for three days because I'm going to be changing probably twice a day. Three times a day most likely. Probably in the morning, in the afternoon, and then at night because that's how well, there's probably going to be two times a night for dinner and then for after dinner, which we're going to be like going walking around the cruise. Because dinner outfits, I can only be in those for like an hour and a half and then I'm out of them because they're so uncomfortable. Then I have this tube top that is from Hollister and it is white, navy blue, like this tan color and light blue. And I don't know if I'll wear this one because I don't really like how this one looks on me. But it's just like an extra just in case maybe someone else wants to wear it. And then I'm bringing this. This one is from Hollister and it is this yellow tank top and it's like, it has like flowers on it and it's really cute. So I'm bringing all my Gina tops. So this one is, these are all from Brandy Melville. And this one is just blue and it has flowers on it. Then I have my red one with no flowers on it. It's just plain red. And I'm probably not gonna wear all of this clothes. <laughs> But whatever, it's just extra. And then I have this long sleeves. And this one's also a Gina top, but it's just long sleeves. And it's really cute. So those are all my Gina tops that I have. And those are the ones I'm bringing. And then I stole this from my cousin also. She doesn't like this shirt, but I like am in love with it. I just think it's so cute. And it's just white. And it's kind of see-through, so you have to wear like a white bra. But it's just a white shirt. And it's really cute. I don't really have white shirts. So when I saw this one, I was like, I'm stealing this. So I'm taking it on the cruise with me. So, that is all of the shirts and stuff. Well, actually I have one more shirt top type of thing. And this top is for the captain's night, which is the night that you have to dress up fancy and like the men have to wear tuxedos and ties and all that stuff. So for that night, I'm wearing this. It's kind of like the shirt I just showed you guys, but this is from Hollister and it is just a long sleeve version of that shirt. And it is a bodysuit. And I love this because you can wear this with so much things. So I just got this and it's just a long sleeve bodysuit. It's really cute. And to go with that, I'm going to be wearing these black American Eagle jeans. This is an outfit that I know. And these ones are just ripped at the knee. So I can wear these for school also because I really wanted some black ripped jeans. But like not fully ripped so I can wear them to school. So I'm going to be wearing the white long sleeve bodysuit with these black ripped jeans. But that's a really boring outfit. So to spice up the outfit just a little bit, I'm going to be wearing the Gucci belt to make it like look better. Cause like it just looks so plain with just black and white and like white bands. So I'm going to be wearing the Gucci belt that we got in New York. It's gonna look super cute. I can't wait for that outfit. It's one of my favorite outfits I'm bringing. Well, I don't really know the other outfits, but that's one of my favorites that I already know. Now that we already started talking about jeans, I'm gonna show you guys the rest of the jeans I'm bringing. I'm bringing a total of four jeans. And they're all ripped because, like, I'm not going to bring my plain jeans. They're so boring. These are some, like, olive, not olive green. These are kind of, like, a light green color. And they are ripped everywhere. They're so ripped, and I love these. These are so cute. So I'll be wearing these with some outfit. I don't know what I'm going to wear these with. Maybe, like, the white shirt, the regular white shirt. Hopefully I don't forget anything because that'll be bad, but everybody's wearing such cute clothes like me, Kaylee, and Ava, so I might just steal some of theirs just for the day or for the night. <laughs> and then I have this pair of jeans, and me and Kaylee both are probably bringing these. They're just these like light wash um, American Eagle jeans. These are all from American Eagle except for the next pair I'm about to show you guys, but these are so cute. I love these. These don't really fit me properly because they're too big. These are just ripped all the way down, even at the ankles. And I love these jeans because they just look so good on. And I just love ripped jeans. These are probably more for like during the night outfits because the shorts that I'm bringing are going to be for like the day or the night night after dinner. And these are from Hollister. They are just white jeans. And these ones are ripped from the knee below. And they're really cute. I've had these for a while. Those are the jeans that I'm going to be bringing. As I said, I'll probably be using the jeans just at night, like for dinners. 
because there's three dinners. So I'll probably wear them for dinners and then I'll probably change into shorts after the dinner or sweatpants. So now we're gonna move into shorts and I'm bringing almost every pair of Lululemon shorts that I own, so it's pretty bad. But I am bringing my blue ones, my black ones. These are like the new, like this is like one of the new designs and they just have, I don't know what it's called, but kind of has like writing on it, but it's in a different color black. So I'm bringing these ones as well. I am bringing my camo ones, which I love. I love these camo ones. I'm bringing my kind of like my spandex ones. And then I'm bringing these light pink ones. Um, these are all of them. I don't know where the rest are. Like the black ones my sister has somewhere. So I'm going to be bringing those as well because I love my black ones. And then for denim shorts, I only have two in here right now. Because like if we're going around the ship like in the morning to like go to the pool or something, I'll probably just wear my Lulu's. But just in case, I have these light washed ones from American Eagle and then these dark washed ones from American Eagle. And those are all the jean shorts I'm bringing. I have a lot more. I have no clue where they are though. So we're just gonna be wearing these. And now leggings. I'm just gonna be bringing, I think one or two pair. I think I might bring this pair of leggings. These are from Lulu. And then these ones are also from Lulu and they're just light blue. These are like blue, green. I don't know what they're called, but I'm just gonna bring these just in case. I probably most likely won't use these maybe at night, but Probably won't because leggings are uncomfortable at sometimes. I rather wear shorts, so I probably won't be wearing those, but they're just in, just in case item. So that is all the clothes, I think. I don't know. But now we're gonna move on to this section of the suitcase. And I don't have all the shoes that I'm bringing yet because I'll probably be wearing them in the next few days and I'll put them in my suitcase right before we leave. But yes, I'm gonna show you guys everything that I have in this section. <laughs> so let's start off with bras. I am bringing so much bras, it's like kind of bad. We're going for three days. Because I have my push, this is not a push up, is it? I don't know. We have this one. We have bra, we have so many bralettes. We have one, two, three, four, five. We have five bralettes. They're all black and white. <laughs> I think these are my, okay, so this one, these two are from Hollister. And these three are from pink, and I think one of these are my sister's. But we're going to just bring it just in case. So, yeah, bralettes. And then we have my push-ups. This is a push-up. And then we have this. This is like a push-up, but also has like elastic. I don't know what it is. And then we have these two. Because like for my tank tops and stuff, I have to wear push-ups or bralettes. So those are all I'm bringing. I'm not bringing any sports bras, which that's usually all I wear. Like I'm wearing a sports bra right now. Like I don't wear push-ups unless like I have to. And then we have socks because these are no-shows because I'm bringing my white bands. Those are the only type of tennis shoes I'm bringing. Not tennis shoes, those aren't even tennis shoes. They're just my white slip-on bands. And then I'm bringing my Burks. And then I'm bringing these Tory Burch sandals that my best friend Ava got me for, my, for Christmas. And then I have my underwear. And I'm just bringing my, what are these, cheekies? I don't know, but these are just the cheeky ones. I don't know what they're called. I actually have some clothes in here. This is just a white zip-up jacket because I bring this on every trip because it's like, it's kind of essential because just like, let, let's just say it's cold out. This is like the perfect jacket for it because we're going to be on a cruise and it's pretty windy out in the middle of the ocean. So bringing this, and this is perfect over any tank top or anything. I always bring this. And then... I have my gray Nike sweatpants because, like, you have to bring sweatpants. At least one pair of sweatpants. So, I'm bringing one pair of sweatpants. And now, moving on to bathing suits. <sighs> so, first bathing suit bottom are these hot pink Hollister bottoms. Then, we have this Target top. And it's just, like, checkered. No, this is, like, a picnic pattern. I don't know. But it's just tied in the front. It just looks like that. And then, we have this. This is from... I don't know, but I got this at a surf shop in Orlando, and it just looks like this. I've never worn this one actually in the water because it shows so much, but it's just an extra one just in case someone else wants to wear it, but it's just this light purple one, and I really like it. It just doesn't fit me, <laughs> and then I have this black top. It just looks like this. Then I have this off-the-shoulder black and white one. This is from Target. I don't know where the black one is from. But this one's from Target. It's just like a mess right now because I don't really know how to use it. 
so much work okay then i got these bottoms from target recently and they're just high-waisted white ones and they look maybe they look like i have a diaper on but i can make it work they just look like this they're scrunched on the sides and then has like a little tied bow at the bottom and then i have these these are from target and they're really old because like the bottom are like really bad i brought these on like four trips so they're just these black and white bottoms and they're really low waisted next one these are from balcom i don't know this is from also from a surf shop in orlando and it's just this polka dot what is that oh it's just this polka dot bathing suit and it looks so tiny but it actually fits me pretty well and i really like the material it's really thin this like fits my sister so this one will be good for any of us on the trip and then this is from hollister and it's just this black one it's just too big on my shoulders but it all if it's some of my if it's ava and kaylee so i'm just bringing it just in case and then it has like tied on the sides and then i have this bathing suit bottom which is from target and it's just like this cheetah print love this the last one is from target as well and it is just this white light pink tan blue ta um, top and it's really cute as well but i've never gotten to wear it with anything that actually matches it because it's like a light color but now that i have the white bottoms i can wear it with that no i'm really picky with bathing suits and i might change throughout the day just for pictures i did that when i was on the beach trip in august i changed like <laughs> like how many times like three times in one day just my bathing suits even if i didn't even go in the water because i wanted to take pictures and I love taking pictures and I love posting on Instagram, especially when I'm on vacation. I really only post when I'm on vacation because like every time else, I just never really take pictures unless I'm on vacation. And when I'm on vacation, I just don't stop taking pictures. That's pretty exciting. So that is, I think, everything I'm bringing. The only things that I have to put in here that aren't in here right now are my white bands and my Birkenstocks, which are downstairs. And then on the day that we go to the dock, I'm probably going to wear these leggings and a sweatshirt so that I have an extra sweatshirt on the cruise. But that is basically everything I'm bringing. If you guys want to see the outfits I end up wearing, go over to my Instagram, Ali.officially, to see all the pictures I take and all the outfits I put together for the cruise of 2020. I am so excited. It's going to be so much fun. On the first day, like, okay, on the first day that you get on the cruise, which is going to be on Friday, you just have to get situated and just find your way around the boat so you know you don't get lost. But we're going to go to the teens club. But we're going to go there. We're going to meet people so we can have friends on the boat. And if we don't make any friends, we have each other, so it's fine. But on the second day, we're going to Nasu, Nassau. I don't know what it's called, but it's in the Bahamas. And my mom um, bought us tickets to go to this aquarium for five hours. It's at the hotel that you see like when you look up Nasu or Nassau, whatever it's called. It's that big hotel and it has like an aquarium in it. We were going to go in it last time we went on the cruise because the last time we went also to the Bahamas. But we didn't end up going to that hotel because we went um, swimming with dolphins on a private island. And it got so tan that day. Oh my god. But that's what we're doing on the first day. We're spending five hours in Nasu in that aquarium place. And then on the second day, we're going to Coco Cay or Coco Bay. I don't know what it's called. But I'm pretty sure it's also in the Bahamas, but it's on a different island, I think. And we're spending the whole day at that water park. So I'm so excited because I'm going to get so tan. Because the sun in like the Bahamas is like so bright and like perfect. I'm super excited. Can't wait to get tan. Can't wait to like not sleep all day but we actually had to sleep because um <laughs> on the we had like okay on the first day we actually had to sleep because on the second morning we're waking up by nine o'clock to go to nassau so we actually kind of have to sleep but it's fine well we always say we're not gonna sleep and then we pass out because we're so tired <laughs> but i'm so excited i'm gonna miss school i'm gonna miss two days of school today is monday actually and i don't have to go to school because it's martha luther king jr day or whatever so we didn't have school and then I only have three days of school and then I have the cruise for four days and I'm going to miss two days of school Friday and Monday and I'm super excited. This week is probably going to go by really fast because I have activities every day after school so that's super fun. Tomorrow which is Tuesday after school I'm getting a facial because my blackheads are Oh, so annoying and then on Wednesday after school I have a bonfire and then on Thursday after school it's my dad's birthday so we're going out to dinner and then Friday 
is the cruise. So this week is just going to be so fun, even though I have school. And I still have homework that I have to do that I haven't done because I didn't go to school on Friday. So I just was like, I'm not going to do my homework until this weekend. And the weekend's almost over because I have school tomorrow and I still haven't done it. Oh my god, I got I have to do so much homework. Oh god, I have math. I have language arts. I don't know if I have civics or science. So yeah, that is it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. And if you guys have ever been on a cruise, comment on my recent on Instagram and comment what your favorite thing about a cruise is. Some people think say that cruises are like dangerous and stuff. They are dangerous, of course. Every vacation you can go on. It has some dangers. But like I just find them so fun because like you literally you you kind of you barely have any Wi-Fi, so you have to really enjoy it. And there's so much fun things to do. And when you're with the right people, it's just a blast. So I'm so excited to go on it. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, peace.